All right, ladies and gentlemen, this is it. We're gonna do it, we're gonna watch it. I haven't seen it yet. This is my reaction to the Godzilla vs. Kong trailer. Um, I am a huge, huge Godzilla uh, and King Kong nerd in general. Here, let me just give you a little peek of how big of a nerd I am. That is my Godzilla collectibles. Um, King Ghidorah there in the background looking awesome. And then over there is all my King Kong stuff. Um, hold on, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna put some better light on so you can actually see it. Okay. Okay, now that I have a light on, maybe, maybe you can see it, so you can see how big of a nerd I, I really am with my Godzilla and King Kong stuff. So, those are all my Godzilla figures and collectibles. This is all my King Kong stuff here. Okay, okay, so I'm also gonna say this <coughs> before I hit play on this video, um, on this trailer, actually, and for one, I don't think that this movie is gonna have, um, and it wasn't exactly box office disappointment, but uh, I know that in some regards, the first and second movie underperformed. I don't think that's going to happen with this movie because I'm just getting around to watching the trailer. It's been a few hours, it, but the social media hype around this movie is already pretty, pretty um, incredible and pretty awesome. It finally feels like movies are starting to come back again, so I'm excited about that. And the second thing that I want to say is that I hope... For the love of God, we get a glimpse at Mechagodzilla. That would be awesome. Um, and I also hope that if they do Mechagodzilla, and they do it right, um, he'll seem like, he should seem like, almost like his own monster. I mean, he's technically a robot and controlled by humans. But, you know, I watched these movies, these old Godzilla movies when I was a little, little kid. But I just remembered him feeling almost like he was his own monster. Um, so I just, I hope they nail that aspect. So we're going to see. I'm excited. Uh, I haven't been this excited in a long time for a movie. So I'm excited to see this. Let's go. Wait, let me go back. Sorry, I looked away. Whoa, what? The? Okay, so they have Kong. Gosh, he's always in chains on a boat or something. How big's this boat got to be to hold this monkey, right? Wow. <laughs> I'm not gonna just sit here and pause that. I shouldn't. I shouldn't. But uh, I just have to. Like, is so. Like, that kind of reminds me of like the Mothra girl uh, in a way. And maybe this is just like some kind of nod to Fey Ray too. Well, with Kong always being so close to humans, I don't know. But uh, this also kind of reminds me of like the Mothra twins. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe it's like a, a blend of both. But this is like a new concept. Uh, Kong being tied to. This little girl, it seems like. Okay. Okay. No more pausing. Why are they fighting Godzilla again? <laughs> it's always awesome to see these CGI shots. Oh my gosh. He's <laughs> eating F-22s. Oh wow. Dude, why they gotta have this music? I don't know why they have this music. What?
Alright, I already got a theory about this. Wow, oh my gosh. <laughs> wow, King Kong is fucking badass, dude. Okay, okay, this looks so, so sick. I got a theory, I got a theory. So they didn't show Mechagodzilla, but maybe they did show Mechagodzilla. There's a, uh, a Godzilla versus Mechagodzilla movie, right? That came out in the 1970s. Let me go ahead and pull this up here. All right, you see what this is? This is Godzilla fighting Mechagodzilla. This, what this was, was, I don't remember which of these Godzillas in this frame it is. One of these Godzillas, was fake. It was Godzilla in disguise. Uh, or it was Mecha Godzilla in disguise as Godzilla, and I think that's exactly what that is. Uh, yeah, that's probably exactly what that is. I'm like 99% sure. Here's a good shot. That was the fake Godzilla that was actually Mecha Godzilla. So, so yeah, that's my whole theory. That's not Godzilla. That's Mecha Godzilla in disguise as Godzilla wreaking havoc. Um, this is going to be great. I've been a lifelong fan of Godzilla my whole life. I've watched all the movies as a little kid, so I even remember um, <clears throat> this stuff here. This is a, they, they did Mecha Godzilla multiple times, uh, and they did a lot of different designs, and uh, it's definitely what they're going to do. Um, and Kong looks awesome. It's going to be cool to see his little battle axe, but I just wish they didn't need to use that, that, that music. I don't know why they used that overdone, that tacky music in the trailers. I, like rock music or whatever they use i don't know why they can't just like try to make it epic they almost have to go for like this level of tackiness uh, but it's cool so whatever it's gonna be awesome to see these cgi monsters fight and uh yeah that's my reaction so i hope you guys enjoyed please like please comment and uh please subscribe that'd be awesome and until next time i'll see you guys later Bye. science editor steve newman reports on one person already using the brand new system